Elephants are among the world's most famous animals and a favorite of many people. Only the African and Asian species survive today, but in the last 40 million years, the planet Earth has been home to over 600 varieties of these pachyderms. One of the most recognizable was the woolly mammoth, which first appeared about 400,000 years ago. This hairy giant of the Ice Age was closely related to modern elephants, but was also different in many ways. The elephants we know today are found in warm tropical regions of Africa and Asia. The mammoth, on the other hand, was a resident of frozen tundra. It could be found in Canada, Alaska, Northern Asia, and Europe. It lived as far south as Spain, which was much colder at that time. Like their modern cousins, however, mammoths traveled in herds led by females and fed on plants. The woolly mammoth was about the size of an African elephant, growing to around 11 feet high at the shoulders and weighing almost 6 tons. Their tusks were long and curved. The biggest known tusk was 14 feet long and weighed 201 pounds. By contrast, the record length for an African elephant's tusks is about 11 feet. Like African and Asian elephants, scientists believe that woolly mammoths gave birth to their young after a 22-month gestation period and lived to be about 70 years old. The most noticeable difference in the woolly mammoth is the thick furry coat that covered its body. It was made of a wiry outer layer about 30 centimeters long and a woolly inner layer. But this coat wasn't the mammoth's only defense against the cold. The frozen regions they inhabited made it hard to find food sometimes, so they had an extra layer of fat that they used as an emergency food store. Today's elephants have big ears to get rid of excess body heat. Think of them as natural radiators. In freezing climates, mammoths needed to preserve their body heat, so their ears were very small. Like elephants, Scientists believe a healthy adult mammoth had no natural predators, except of course for human beings, who hunted them for food and their furs. Saber-toothed cats and dire wolves may have preyed on juveniles. Like many other Ice Age animals, the woolly mammoth is now extinct. It is believed that overhunting and the warming climate that ended the Ice Age contributed to the extinction of these mighty giants across most of their range about 10,000 years ago. However, some isolated populations survived. The last known population lived on Wrangell Island in the Arctic Ocean until about 4,000 years ago, well after the rise of human civilization began. It was during that time that the Great Pyramid was being built in ancient Egypt. Scientists today understand a great deal about woolly mammoths because many specimens have been discovered frozen in the Arctic ice. Some were so well preserved they still had fur on their bodies. One scientific banquet even served portions of mammoth steak to its guests. Imagine serving that at your next family barbecue. The woolly mammoth remains one of the most famous prehistoric animals. They may no longer be found on Earth, but like their elephant cousins, they have firmly established a place in both science and the human imagination. Next time on Gone from Earth, we will get to know an ancestor of modern cattle. Be sure to subscribe for more Wildlife Chronicles, and to comment below on what other extinct creatures you would like to see on Gone from Earth. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on our next adventure.